Botanical illustration really trains people to look closely at the world around them. So this is the 40th anniversary of the school of uh, the School of Botanical Art and Illustration at Denver Botanic Gardens and the 30th anniversary of our certificate program. It is the oldest scientific illustration what is around there. Um, it, it has always been connected to medicine, herbalism and medicine. Botanical illustration is important because it captures the details of plants that a photograph cannot. It can capture all life stages of a plant from the seed right through to the, the flowering and ultimately the death and everything from the roots to every part of the plant all at once. So in essence it's the artistic part of being able to render something by hand that actually makes it more important and more valuable. It's also a really nice bridge between the art world. I mean botanical illustrations, they can be beautiful, stunning and science, so it helps communicate science in a way that regular scientific papers and whatnot just can't. It's also a great way to get away from the computer, get back to the basics, and back to hand drawing and hand techniques. Seeing the plant come to life on paper. I mean, there are these moments where it's, it's almost magical. We're taking a three-dimensional plant and we're seeing it um, translated onto a two-dimensional piece of paper. And then there is that scientific component, that, those moments of discovery where you're just, you learn so much about each subject. Being a botanical illustrator has really improved my observation skills and my appreciation for nature. It opens your eyes. Our primary goal in the school always was to learn to open your eyes, to see what you actually see and not ignore anything. One of the most memorable moments was uh, last year when we had our um, graduation ceremonies and we had two graduates there among those, one who was 15 years old and the other one who was 83. And Sirinia, she studied her studies when she was 11 years old. He's just been a remarkable student. When I graduated and received the foundational certificate, I was so ecstatic because I'd been working for it four or five years. I'm hoping to tie my botanical illustration certificate into my future educational and career plans since I'm planning on studying environmental science and public policy in college. The uh, perception that you would need to know something about art in order to come to our program or you need to know something about the science in order to produce anything in our program. None of that is, is necessary because we teach everything. We teach the techniques, how to use them, and how to make the plant to come to, to life, and we teach the science behind it. I definitely look at plants in a different way. Um, I also just really enjoy my time with the class. Um, being able to, to slow down, to focus really intently on my subject matter. Um, and it's a form of meditation. Um, it's, a, it's a good Zen space to be in. The students of Botanical Art and Illustration have always had the possibility to exhibit their work within the student shows here at Denver Botanic Gardens and also in special exhibits within other institutions. In 2017, we submitted an exhibit, group exhibit, to the Royal Horticultural Society's annual exhibit and uh, we got a gold medal, which was the third within the history of the uh, Royal Horticultural Society's exhibits, uh, which started in the beginning of 1900. Probably the largest international accomplishment for us and the largest international accreditation for our program.
The School of Botanical Art and Illustration is world renowned for its focus on botanical illustration, but I'm hoping that we can actually reach a wider audience and grow the focus on botanical art while respecting the tradition of botanical illustration that the school is known for.